13 first, alert weather. I like that story. All right, take a look. Uh, blue sky, likely staying that way all weekend long. We, we want that, but we've got to add in that stronger wind. We won't see it in the overnight hours so much, but wait till uh, not even really uh, the morning hours. Really, I think the rest of the evening, we're going to see just a light breeze. But the, once we get into the overnight hours through Saturday, I don't see much going on. Look at that. It's just maybe a couple double digit wind speeds, but mostly relatively calm. It's when we get into the afternoon. Watch how things change in your area. Look at that. We're really starting to push up the winds. Upper elevations as well. A lot of events in the upper elevations. I wouldn't say don't do them. That's for sure. Go enjoy them. Uh, but just know that there's going to be some wind there, but the temperatures will be spectacular. That's the thing. But we got wind in the valley as well. So uh, lake wind advisory, but no other wind advisory. So I think the real chop will be on the water. Uh, you can see even by 10 p.m. We're keeping the winds up and some of that will linger into Sunday, but only early Sunday. See, it's things start to calm down by Sunday afternoon and evening, and that's nice. Temperatures as well will start to push up. We knew we were going to get into right around the 100 degree realm today, but probably low 100s across the valley for tomorrow. But just to give you a little forecast of the weekend, windy on Saturday, but 70s. That's beautiful. Mount Charleston overnight lows in the 50s. Nice, nice weather there. Okay, 13 first alert, Sat Red. What's going on? Nothing here. Let me show you what's going on. Remember, we barely had a tropical storm the other day. It was barely a tropical depression. Look at this. Doesn't look like much, but look at that tightly wound alive. The fact that you can see it right here, right now, that means that's a very intense storm. We shouldn't be able to see that this far up. Let me show you what that storm means. That's a cat four. That's a big deal. Oh, it ran into some really nice warm waters and just strengthened in a few hours time to a cat three, now a cat four. Not quite sure it'll make it to a cat five, but you get an idea. It's staying away from land, and that's all you really need to know about Aletta. That is a big storm. All right, just keep it out to sea. So far, here's the setup for the weekend. We know we're going to drop temperatures down, bring them back up again for next week. Look at that. Yeah, 105, 106, maybe even some 107s before it's all said and done. But in general, we're talking right around 106 through midweek. Back to you, Carla. All right, thanks, Brian.